In this video, we're going to look at how to create graphs in SAS. Um, we're going to look at scatter plots and um, um, and histograms. So, the the first procedure we're going to look at is proc chart, and this will will give us a um, um, a histogram, so to speak. So proc chart data equals mat008.jjj so that's the particular data set we're looking at, the library uh, and the, the data set. So finish the semicolon and then we write what the v bar is. So v bar is height in meters and run. So v bar is a SAS keyword that simply um, says we want vertical bars for, for height in meters. Submit that. Let's take a look at our output, which is there. And that is our histogram. Now, we're going to see how that can be done slightly better using a different procedure. So I don't think that's the nicest way of getting a um, histogram. The other way to get a histogram is to, and another way of getting a histogram is to use the univariate procedure, which we've seen before to get more summary statistics. Um, but we can throw in an option um, that will give us a histogram. So we use the var statement because we don't want to, to run the univariate procedure on, on everything. So we just want height in meters. And we simply put in histogram right there. And if we run that, first of all what comes up is all sorts of things relating to the um, um, to the univariate procedure that we've seen before. But if we actually go to our results pane, we haven't used this much so far, but if we go to our results pane we actually see everything. So this is the, the chart procedure we ran previously, then we ran the univariate procedure, and if I click on that, height in meters, and if I click on the histogram, click down through the menus and go to panel 1, click on that and open it, the histogram opens up. Let me just grab that. The histogram opens up. And so that's a much nicer histogram. We can then um, save this as a, as various as a, as a GIF or, or an EPS and, or as po PostScript, Adobe PostScript. And we can just export that, that video, that picture, pardon me. So um, that's the, the, the easiest way of getting a, a histogram. There are a variety of number of options that can be added on, but we're not going into that in the video. There's so much stuff out there. Um, if you just Google proc univariate or proc um, chart. Okay, so now how to get a scatter plot. So plot, sorry, proc proc plot data equals mat 8jjj dot jjj and I say I want to plot height in meters against weight in kg and if I run that and again so we have this plot here and if we open this up we see the plot has appeared of height in meters and weight in kg um, but again, I I think there's a better better way of getting this, and it's actually using a procedure called proc gplot. And now the syntax is exactly the same. Mat dot jjj plot height in meters against weight in kg, and run that. Oh, at least one plotable state must be given. So, ah, I had a spelling mistake here, right? So I saw a bit of red in my blog. Log, need to look up something, and this should now run without a problem. Okay. So, first of all, we got the G plot, and here we have the window with our our scatter plot. 